Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Flattop County in Transport Fever 2. Well, just got uh, over here the uh, the goods factory connected up to steel. Now I need to bring the uh, plastic all the way from here over to here. Now, this is going to be a little bit of a challenge, but not that much of one. Uh, I'm, I'm going to run the freight tracks just along here. And I'll have to rebuild this bridge and a little bit of finagling. And then I can set off cross country here. Uh, and I think punch through the mountain here and then come around through here. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. So I'm going to get started on that. Uh, I'm going to pause it here. I'm going to knock this out so that I can rebuild that. And right, that means I'm going to need tracks. This one will do. Uh, no, I don't need to electrify it. Okay, so I should just need the one. I'm going to put the crossover or the, the, the points or switch or whatever you want to call them back a bit from the, the station and right uh, let's punch that through here uh, just like so now I'll just while I'm here I'll finish the bridge yeah okay and this one oh this should uh, go quite nicely how's that actually look what is that one center part of the something or other huh <laughs> cute now I think no I think that's not enough clearance okay uh, what about this guy? That doesn't seem like it's strong enough to hold anything. And it's more clearance than it actually needs. What about this? Nope. Uh, what about one of these? No. Maybe. No. Okay. This one, still too thin. Um... Right. Oh, what about one of these? You know what? That isn't going to work. Uh, it, it train's going to drive through the arches. Okay. No. Wait, what did I do? Go with this guy. Yeah, go with that guy. Okay, that's good. Right. Now, uh, this guy is in the way. And on we go with the tracks going here. Okay. Now, I can restart time. And the uh, operators there won't uh, build everything in the way. Yeah, so now I need to strike off across the flats here. So, but I kind of want to go over the, nope, over the highway. So if I come out like this, uh, can I get, oh, 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 that could, that could be, yeah, we got a cut, and we've got what kind of a viaduct can what can we use this viaduct? You know what? I think we can. Except for the bridge pillar collision. Oh. Okay. So we can't use that there. Well, that's what the center part thingy is for, obviously. 
So I could build this. Yeah. Okay. So, so if I build that, that's level. It doesn't need to be. Okay. Build that. Okay. Now I can take this business out and rebuild it. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Rail. Okay. Now we come up to here and we build the thing with this one. Um, no, I don't like it. Okay, don't build it. Right, okay. Well, bring this across, try a different bridge. Uh, okay, what's this? Actually, that works. It does. I don't even know what it is, but it works. Okay. Yeah, okay. That that I can live with. So I'll just build the other track here. Because, I mean, there's no point not double tracking if you've got uh, almost two billion in the in the bank that you can rinse on on a project. Yeah. That's actually a practical viaduct. Okay, now, uh, where do I want to punch through the mountain here? I think right about here. So, so if we come out, come through like this. Yeah. Okay. Now, what happens if I crow fly this? Okay. I get a whacking great viaduct. Uh, that, oh, actually, what's it look like on this side? You know what? I'm going to take that, and then I'm going to take this bit out. Yeah, okay. Now, this bit can get that same blue box thingy, or purple box, or whatever it is. Yeah, okay. Right. Good. Yeah, I think that's going to be perfectly acceptable. Now, double track the tunnel. Yeah. Now, coming through here, I kind of want to come in and come in along this track. I kind of do. Yeah. So that means I want to punch through here. Yeah. So that means I need to back this up just a couple of segments. Yeah. And this guy needs to pop around here. And that, yeah. That can be an embankment. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I can get behind that idea. Okay, and then we come out here. Okay, now, I want to come in off of here on the same track? Yeah, on the same track, I think. Um, yeah, I do think I want to wait. Um, no, don't do that. Just pop around from here down to here. Here? Yeah, there. Okay. That. Ah. Well, that might be an argument for coming down beside. Nah. Uh, pop that in there. Right. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah, need another one of those fancy viaduct thingies here. Um, let's go with that thing again. Yeah. Okay. Good. Now what are we going to do? Well, let's see. What, what are the lines doing here? Ah, we only need the one track there, huh? Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, configure. Take that platform out. Take that track out. Okay. And take this business out. Uh, back to there. Back to there. Okay. Uh, you know, you didn't really need to take that much out. Yeah, more. Okay. So you bring this around. And then you bring this around. Actually, that works okay. Okay, right. Just build the track all the way. Okay, good. Now, I need to do one of these. Yeah, and slip that. Yeah, okay. That, yeah, that should be fine. Now, I need to put the signals back in here. Uh, so we're going to need a signal here and a signal here. We're going to need the signals back over here. And maybe another set here just for queuing purposes. And over here. Yeah, okay. Uh, you can spread these ones out way more. There's only going to be like a handful of trains on here maximum. Right? So don't need a huge number of these things but I do like the look of driving by the odd signal periodically so put a few okay and need one here yeah okay that has definitely got a train connection there. Now, uh, I need over here to configure this uh, platform. What? No. Right. And I'm going to need, oh, no, 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 no. All right, I want a track here. Yeah, okay. Now I want the platform. Right, okay, good. All right. Now what do I do? Uh, well, I go in here, I grab a track, and I do well, I come up a couple bits, and then I do this. And I do this. And I go ahead and add a signal here and take that one off. Yeah. Okay, that should not break anything. And it means the train that's turning doesn't block the through trains uh, while it's dwell, during its dwell time. Okay. Now, in here where I've got a train thingy, I can buy a train. Now, I want diesel, and I think this will be the SD40. Uh, also, cargo. 
I'm going to need a box cars, right? Box cars. Now this one does 18. That one does 18. That one does 13. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go with this one. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, it's lighter. Yeah, every, everything else is the same, though. Yeah, okay. So... So if I put eight of them on a train, then I get a capacity of 144. And I definitely fit the platform at the other end. Okay. I'm going to put four of them on the line. Because it's a long line. And... New line. Uh, we're going to pause it. And... Where is it? Here. Bellows pass. And... Bayside Chemical. Okay. Bellows. Yeah. No. Bayside Chemical to Bellows Goods. Okay. Now, what are we going to do? We are going to... We're going to ride the train. And let it poke its nose out. Okay. Now we're going to ride the train just to see what this track looks like. And this should be a non-stop because we can't get to the chemical plant from this direction. Because I didn't plumb that in on the track, which is fine. Okay. So this is just getting to the, the line. And here we are at the chemical place. Okay, and a train is going to take some uh, some plastics. Uh, the fur this one will when it gets back there. Okay, and we come up here, we blast past the platform. Okay, now we we head on. You know, I kind of wish they might render more of the map that they actually store uh, when in first person, you know, so the edge isn't quite as close. I get why they don't, but it'd be a neat idea, I think. You know what? I think this line turned out okay. It did, yeah. Uh, I actually like the viaduct on here. Uh, it turned out good and the bridge turned out okay here yeah and on into the station where we head right up toward a pillar that just seems appropriate as well now let's see what things look like uh, wandering through here on this direction oh look it's another train and there'll be another train and then there'll be another train yeah Okay. Train. Tunnel. Auto save. That little bend at the end of the tunnel there. Train. Uh, it seems like it's. Uh, it seems kind of appropriate. Yeah, these tunnels don't seem like they're overly long, so I, I'm good with that. And the, the viaduct bits are are quite uh, 
quite good. And we are going to wait for that train to make a hole. And off we go. Yeah, well, that worked out okay. And here we go. Let's let's jump out of here. And we will see a full train load. Probably. Fair chunk of a train load anyway. Fair chunk of a train load. Uh, what's the uh, line rate on here? 528. Ah, uh, yeah. It's overkill. I got one too many trains on there. Uh, I'm going to leave them, though, because I kind of like the number of trains, right? And there's enough time here to plumb in a couple of local delivery lines as well to get to just kick up the uh, operation here. So I'm going to grab a couple of drop off points uh, where over here. Where can I put it that's not going to be in the way? I could put it... I could put it here. No, I could put it here. Oh, I see what I can do with this. Okay. I can put a road there. Right. And I can put it here. Yeah. Yeah. Put it there. Okay, so I have a drop off there. And also a drop off. Oh, here? Yeah. Here. No. Here? Nah. Here. Okay, just drop it off there. Uh, right. So, if I jump in here and I buy vehicles. Now, the 40 ton. Okay. Hmm. You know what? The 40 ton would be okay. Yeah, or I could go with the gas, which carries only 16, but it's also got a fast loading speed. You know what, I'm going to go with the 40 ton, and I'm going to put two on one line and four on the other. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go from here to here. And this is freight bellows. Flat delivery flats. A. Okay. And we go in here and we do new line going from there to there okay no no this one is bellows delivery flats a yeah uh, this is pass a is that the right one yeah pass okay now um, are we yeah we don't have any plastic in there 
So we're waiting for a train to arrive. There's a train coming. Okay. Right. So that's going to start delivering goods to Bellows, and that should that should kickstart some development. Now, I could also uh, ferry in uh, machines or something from somewhere else and drop them at this station, and this will deliver it as well. So that's uh, that's quite that's quite useful for. Uh, continuing uh, operations uh, but we've got yeah we've got uh, goods appearing on the platform so that is good I'll just up the tempo here a bit more and then we can observe what's doing yeah okay uh, that is doing a thing. So in here, no, in here, we're looking for 108 of those, right? And are we actually delivering any? Where there's a truck. Uh, you know, come on, click on it. Two. We delivered two. We have an ICE one uh, available apparently. Uh, right now, click back on here. Two. Yeah. Uh, okay. Right. So. Uh, I think perhaps there might be some tuning to do next time and maybe the con mats can uh, can come in and uh, do some sort of operation here and I think this will be trucks as well and then I can truck con mats into wherever they're wanted to yeah uh, you know what I think that's probably what I'll do uh, or maybe I won't uh, we'll see Anyway, uh, that's all for this one. Uh, we got uh, goods being delivered in Bellows, in Flats and Pass. And those are, I believe, primary uh, uh, cargoes, so it's not likely going to run out of uh, demand for those. Uh, it's not like the towns are going to shrink anyway. Uh, right. Uh, Okay, now we're delivering some of the stuff there. Uh, we're delivering here. So, well, we'll get a plus 10% on that. Okay, right. So I need to up the production of plastic, and I can do that by going up and connecting the other, uh, the other uh, oil well. Uh, and that will just, that will kick up the, that stuff over there. Okay, uh, well, I'm going to put the cut here. Uh, next time, I think I'll, I'll be balancing the lines out a bit here, getting some things going, and probably uh, maybe getting a start on the con mats, I think. Anyway, uh, that's all for this time. So on the way out, I'll mention I have a Patreon. The link is in the description if for some reason you want to use it, or you can ignore it, you know, there, that's an option too, always. And all that's it. See you back next time.